Hello, White Bear Lake. <laughs> Welcome to Orc Jam 2022. Um, my name, yeah, I like that. That was a great, I appreciate that enthusiasm over there. Um, my name is Mr. Weinhold. I teach orchestra at Sunrise Park Middle School. And what you, yeah, what you are about to hear is every string student in the District of White Bear. Heck yeah. We will, we will start with our youngest students, and then we will move from fifth grade to sixth grade, and then seventh grade, and then eighth grade, and then we will hear the high school students, and then we will all play Ode to Joy together at the end, and it's going to be amazing. But before we get started, it's so interesting to have to look all around in every direction at our audience. It's not very often that you get to come to an orchestra concert in a hockey arena, am I right? Which makes me think it's not very often that you get to do the wave at an orchestra concert. So. I feel, like, I feel like this would be a missed opportunity if we didn't just try it right now. So just humor me for a second. We're going to start on this side, and we're going to go all the way around, and we're going to end on this side. We're not going to go, keep going around and around, okay? Are you ready? If you're ready over there, wave at me. Oh, they're ready. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, go! <laughs> this side! Thank you for indulging me. Okay, now, um, for this concert, we, this is not like an audit, this is not an auditorium kind of applause that we do. We are in a hockey arena. So we will cheer like we cheer in a hockey arena. So we're, be, before we get there, I just wanted to sort of go, with, go through how we applaud at Orc Jam. Okay, so maybe we're gonna say for the scale from one to 10, starting at one, one would be like, just maybe two, like two, two fingers, right, this in the, in the palm of your hand. Can you all do that for me? Yeah, that's, that's a one. And then a two would be sort of like a golf clap, right? And let's hear, let's hear a golf clap. Okay, so we're gonna go through, we're gonna go through all the way up to 10. By the way, I would say an eight would be, or a nine, I don't know, what would be more, winning the lottery or the Vikings winning the Super Bowl? That would be like, that would be like a nine. And then 10, of course, obviously is when I introduce the fifth grade orchestra, am I right? Okay, so we're gonna, yeah, so we're, Yes, we're gonna start at one, okay? And then when I get to five, six is gonna look a lot like one this thing, okay? And, and by the time that I get to eight, I'm gonna, introduce, I'm gonna introduce the fifth graders. Are you with me? Remember, number one is your, what was it? Oh, the two fingers, right? Okay, here's number one. Here's number two, golf clap. Okay, three, four, five, six, seven. Introducing the fifth grade orchestra! Take from here, Miss Elliot.
Hey, audience. That was, we love your applause. But let's be honest, that was about a five or a six. Let's hear it for the sixth grade orchestra! Thank you for that much deserved applause. That was great. And now I'm leaving it to Miss Placky and the seventh grade orchestra. They're going to play Joust. And before we get to eighth grade and then high school, I just wanted to mention we do have summer orchestra this summer. Has anyone participated in summer orchestra before? Maybe a couple years ago, some of the eighth graders? Yeah. So summer orchestra is super fun and it's available for um, kids going into sixth grade all the way to going into ninth grade. And this year's theme is Animal Kingdom. So you can guess that our music is going to be animal themed. We even have theme days where we dress up like certain animals or like certain movies that include animals, things like that. Um, we play a bunch of games. We have high school helpers that are going to help us learn more music. We play in small groups, 
big groups, and it's super fun. It's a great way for kids to get a little bit more playing over the summer and to meet the people that they're going to be in middle school with, including their teachers. So if you are interested in joining Summer Orchestra, which we had 120 the last year that we did it, so I'm hoping we can surpass that number this year because um, it's super fun and it's great to see you all there. Um, if you're interested, please email your orchestra teacher. There's also information in the program. If you didn't see up on these red pillars on either side, there are QR codes. You can get to the program that way. And there is some information about Summer Orchestra on the last page. So again, Summer Orchestra having this summer, I hope to see most of you there. Thank you so much. concert program. Um, for those of you who have been to my concerts this spring, I actually wrote stuff down so I don't just ramble for a few minutes. Um, so first, I want to thank our administrators. Tons of them are here. If you are a principal or an associate principal or any administrator, so can you stand up or wave? Yeah, we got some over there. We got more. Yes. They are here. They have been helping. They were directing traffic. They are so supportive of our music department, not only in orchestra, but in all of our music, all of our music programs in White Bear. They are amazing, and thank you so much um, to all of our teachers and all of our buildings who let these students, um, especially fifth grade and middle schoolers, come to their lessons and go to ensemble and miss a little class to practice for rehearsals for concerts. It takes their time, but it's so worth it. Um, thank you to our awesome high school volunteers. If you volunteered, can you raise your hand? They helped set up 
600 plus chairs today in like 30 minutes. All right, couple, couple more. Uh, thank you to you students. You have been amazing to work with this year. You have gone through a lot with distance learning and a pandemic and COVID, and it's so awesome to hear you all and hear all of your progress. This year has been great. Um, and thank you. Can all of you students give a big round of applause to your parents? Thank you to you that we have students to be here in the first place and supporting them and making them practice even though sometimes they don't want to. That never happens, right? Never happens. But thank you to you that we have this and these kids are doing awesome. Okay, the real reason that I'm here <laughs> is to talk about um, our music boosters in White Bear Lake. So our music boosters is an amazing program um, that supports all of these students beyond what we can do as just a typical school music program. So our music boosters are made up of parents, <coughs> parents of music students. So <clears throat> if you're interested, check the website out for more information and for volunteering opportunities. Um, but they provide lesson scholarships for students. They provide scholarships for graduating seniors. Um, before COVID, we could have refreshments at concert and they help support that with, with parent volunteers and they supplied all of that. They've commissioned a piece for uh, our, our high school band choir and orchestra to play one day when that commission is done. They've just done so much. Um, so there's a little QR code on your digital program. Um, go home, check them out. Do the, I don't know how you do a QR code off of what's already on your phone. I'm not that technologically great. Um, but. But all of this that they do comes from donations, so just a couple of dollars to help go towards that and to pay for us renting this space. They, they provide the payment for renting this huge space to do this. So please, any support would be much appreciated. All right, I think that's it. Yeah, Boosters! And the high school next!
Um, just a couple items of business. Um, we, yes, we had all of those wonderful high school volunteers. Thank you again. Um, this would not have been set up as quickly nor efficiently if you hadn't been here. Now, we get to have all these chairs put away, but we have even more volunteers here, because you're here. So, please, while you're waiting for your student to pack up, it does take a little bit of time, uh, please come down here, help us pack them up. We need stacks of 20. There are about 700 chairs here right now. So please don't have us pack them all up. Um, so before you leave, please pack up for us, get these chairs away. Um, you don't have to move them anywhere, just stack them. Um, and then also, on your way out, we will have, um, I believe they have named their sel themselves the Bucketeers. I believe, right? We have bucketeers back there, yeah? They are collecting donations as well as you are not technologically savvy to donate online and you are interested in doing so, we will have bucketeers available to take cash donations for our boosters. Because again, this being here couldn't happen. They funded this for us and these kiddos have been great. So we have one more piece for you. We hope you enjoy it. This is kind of a White Bear Lake tradition. So enjoy our final, con uh, our final concert piece.
Thank you all. Have a good night.